Welcome to my world. Welcome back to Crypto Madness. Another day, another workout. Today we're going to be working on slipping. That's why I got my boy Bob back there with um, another one of my hand wraps. I wrapped it around him. I locked it to the door. So that's going to be our line. The line is going to help us visualize somebody's punch and see the same way. This is what we're visualizing. We're visualizing somebody's doing this. So we're gonna dip underneath. Underneath this, we're gonna slip and roll under uh, the punches, basically. That's what this line is for, for slipping and rolling. So this is a, a workout you can do at home, a drill. You know, for you guys that wanna learn boxing. We're gonna do three rounds. The first round is gonna go just slipping, slipping. That's all we're gonna be doing. Uh, forward, backwards, we're gonna slip. We're gonna slip. Wherever the line is, we're gonna block. We're gonna block. It's just a drill to get you comfortable and used to always blocking. Whenever somebody hitting a, uh, a punch, you're gonna slip it. You always keep that hand up. Uh, the next one would be uppercuts. So we're gonna slip, right? Wherever you're gonna slip. If we're gonna slip this way, with this hand up, this this is not gonna be the executing hand, it's gonna be this one. So we're gonna roll and go up cut. And we're gonna roll, switch, up cut. Same thing with the hook. Hook, hook. All right guys, so let's get into these workouts. I mean, basically this is a drill. Uh, we're only doing two minutes, uh, three rounds. Very basic, very quick. Do this about five times a week and you should be you know good money with it you'll be you know your body will start getting used to it you start getting used to moving around you know what i mean so let's get this cracking um two minutes i'm setting my timer i'm, I'm gonna put my timer on me in my pocket here um matter of fact i'm gonna leave my timer here and i'm gonna set it so we're gonna have 30 second rest so it's two minute and then 30 second rest in between. So let's start. All right, we're gonna start right here. Start at the end of the rope. Keep your hand up, get in the stance, drop, right? Here we go. We're gonna do all these drills slowly so you guys can get the hang of it. So it's like this. Oh, another thing, it has the line has to be to, to the size of your neck by your jaw around your jaw side um, so we're gonna slip slip look my foot my lead foot is gonna it's gonna take a step and then you're gonna drop and roll like a U a U Take a step. Now we're gonna go back. As we go back, we're gonna block. 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 Very simple, forward, moving, uh, forward is moving, backwards is going to be blocking. So the next one is going to be like this, forward 
and backwards, it's going to be the upper cut. So, here we go. It extends. We're going to do it slowly. Don't worry, we don't have to rush. Right? Upper cut. Come back down. Upper cut. Step. Get in the hang of moving your head away from the from the line like this. So you're gonna this is the line. And then you come up. Like that. You don't want to stay in the same spot. You don't want to do that. Because you're going to keep getting hit. The whole point is for you to avoid getting hit. We're going to do another drill with the noodle after this. Alright, so the next one's going to be the hook. Alright, hook. Alright guys, that was slipping, like I said, the first slip was just slipping, just to get you in, the, in, the, in that mood. The next one is the uppercut. Oh, remember as you're going back, so you're slipping, right, as you're going back, rock. Alright guys, so alright guys, so using a simple noodle for the for a pool noodle. Using a simple noodle can be very effective. This simple little tool that you use for the pool to swim to hold on to the float, we can use it in boxing. We also use it as pad working. It's amazing for pad working. Helps you with your reflexes. And um, now this right here is gonna help us with are dipping and slipping so we're gonna do two minutes non-stop just straight just moving around just dip it underneath that's all we're gonna do for the first uh, round second round we're gonna do the same thing we did with the rope, but now we have an actual uh, target to use those skills. So if we're gonna be slipping here, come back. We're gonna use it to, um, Second round, we're gonna use the hook 
and the third round we're gonna use the uppercut and also if you don't have a dummy if you don't have a dummy or um, if you don't have um, a punching bag get this noodle you see what I did to uh, Bob he looks like he's being kidnapped right now and I strapped him up with all this tape but what I mean is you can actually put this on the wall and just work on the wall you don't need a boxing equipment to do it we can also use this right here for your uppercut so we'll do one minute of just that just uppercuts hooks uppercut hook with the noodle all right guys let's get it so two minutes non-stop underneath just just rolling underneath let me move back so you guys can see better Two minutes. We're gonna get underneath. Alright guys, that was dipping underneath. The next one's gonna be we're gonna do the hooks and then the upper cut. This is a really good workout with this thing. I mean
this next one is going to be uppercuts. So we're going to hit here because we can't get to bottom. And this, when you're when when working this close, you can't. So we're going to make believe that we just hit him in the, in the rib, Bang. slip, and we caught him in the chin when he went down. All right? Here we go. Quick little sweat right there. Um, the last round. One just we're just gonna do one round. And this round is just gonna be uppercuts and hooks. Just on this. Alright guys, hope you guys like this video. Hope it was useful to you guys. Hope it was helpful. Yeah, let me know what you guys think about this workout.
if it's helpful to you let me know in the comments down below if you guys if you guys like this video hit that thumbs up if you don't like the video hit that thumbs down it ain't for everybody it's all good in the hood this is my homemade uh fighting boxing at home pretty soon we're gonna take it back to the gym where it all started but for now we're gonna keep it at the crib so hope you guys like this video uh don't forget to subscribe if you guys like this video hit that like hit that subscribe share it and let me know what you guys think mahala chan the next video